Our hero Geralt of Rivia, known in some parts simply as the White Wolf, or even simpler, the Witcher, is a mercenary monster slayer whose heightened senses, lightning quick reflexes and superhuman strength are the result of the torturous magical experiments he was subjected to in his youth and have made him an outcast to some, a necessary tool to others. As the most renowned member of the Brotherhood of Witchers, bounty hunters hired for the tremendous ability to tame or more commonly kill even the most fearsome beasts, Geralt has been trained since childhood to be a master of the sword. Combat in The Witcher is based on a deep yet intuitive system centered on a timing-based combo sequence. As you progress through the game, you'll be able to spend experience points to upgrade many of Geralt's combat skills, including the combo sequence, increasing the number of attacks you can pull off. Prompted by a variety of on-screen cues, you'll need to click the left mouse button at the right time to string together a series of up to five attacks each one more powerful than the last. Carry out the sequence correctly and you might unleash a stunning finishing move to put your enemies down for good. Oh, and you can't go running into combat expecting to beat up every enemy you face just by clicking at the right time though. This isn't some generic action RPG after all. In his line of work, Geralt needs to be ready for any foe that gets in his way so he has two very different swords at his disposal. As you approach a combat situation, you want to make sure you're using the right sword for the job. The steel sword is most effective against human opponents, while the silver sword is the answer when facing monsters, demons and other non-human enemies. Run into battle unprepared and you just might end up as a dinner for cool. Long trained in battle tactics, Geralt can also switch his fighting style to suit the situation. Switching between strong, fast and troop stances will often make the difference between sweet victory and bitter defeat. The styles are rather self-explanatory. The strong stance will allow Geralt to unleash crippling but relatively slow attacks that will topper large or armored opponents. While the fast stance is a necessity against quicker enemies taking advantage of Geralt's cat-like agility. When facing a group of weaker foes, Geralt is most effective in his group stance which allows him to strike multiple enemies with a single blow. Your foes will always do their best to surround you in battle so the group style may be your only option if you want to escape with your life. While combat in The Witcher focuses on Geralt's sword fighting abilities, magic and alchemy also play a vital role. With five unique magical signs in his arsenal and a huge assortment of ingredients he can blend into potions, Geralt is well equipped for any battle. It's just up to you to make the best use of his available gifts. We'll save the details about magic for another time though. Come on, there are more pressing matters at hand.